My name is Jasmine Gaona. I am an area safety manager for Turner Industries Group. Our focus today is Oxyfeel Beveler Safety. This information was taken from NCCER Module 29102, which is pipe fitting Oxyfeel cutting. I would like to introduce Alexis Villalval, who will be demonstrating the proper operational techniques. The first thing we want to talk about is Oxyfeel's cutting safety. Always dress appropriately. No loose clothing, securing long hair is very important, so we put the long hair inside of a hard hat. Always wear the proper PPE, gloves, goggles, or safety glasses, and face shield are utilized when using these tools. Use any other items according to the test at hand. You should always be trained before using OxyField cutting equipment and qualify to perform the task. When getting ready to use the OxyField equipment, it is critical to set up correctly. Before attaching the regulator and with the outlet facing a safe direction, briefly crack the valve open of the gas supply to clear any debris from the valve. It is necessary also to blow out the hoses with an inner gas such as nitrogen to clear any talc or debris. Check that the hoses have flashback arresters. Installed flashback arresters prevent fires from backflowing to the cylinder or storage location of the gas. Inspect hoses for any burns, cuts, pinholes, or fraying. Check that all hose connections at the regulator and torch are tight but do not over tighten. A leaking hose connection can cause an unwanted fire. Check that the valves on the torch are closed before opening the supply valves and setting regulator pressure. Ensure that the proper working pressure is set on each regulator. Never stand directly in front of a regulator adjustment screws while adjusting. The screw can blow out under pressure and cause a serious injury. Be sure to purge the system and check for leaks. And remember to utilize the appropriate pipe stance and be sure that the pipe is secure. Inspect tools before beginning work. Never alter or modify tools in any way. Tools are only used for the intended purpose. Work within the limits of the tool. Do not force a tool beyond its capability. Do not overreach. Always keep your work area clean. Bevelers are used for cutting pipe to length and or creating a beveled edge, often both at the same time. They are used in both fabrication and field setting. Let's look at a visual of a beveler usage. Beveling is necessary for pipe that is to be welded together. The process creates small clumps of molten metal that will be projected a short distance into the air and surrounding area as the torch is moved around the pipe. Clear work area of flammable debris or trash before use. Ensure co-workers are protected by screens or clear of the area before beginning. Use a proper PPE. Full face protection is required. Attach and secure the machine to the pipe. Stand behind the machine. The torch can create temperatures of 5,500 degrees and hotter. Ensure that the torch will pass freely 360 degrees around the pipe without contacting any of the pipe stands or obstructions. Step one, preheat the pipe the full 360 degrees accordingly, adding additional heat at the point of breakthrough. Helps to avoid blowback of molten metal towards the operator. Step two, open the oxygen lever and begin operating the machine handle consistently at the appropriate speed. Step three, turn off the torch in the proper sequence to avoid backfires and flashbacks. Work safe, work smart, and live to work another day.